involved in politics actually in 1968. And then I got very interested in the whole process about power and the use of power and how you know, somehow or other we could become a conduit between good ideas and problems that needed solving and then make a conduit to the to the levers of power around government to try to do something to, to make those problems, um, you know, resolve them or, or, or mitigate them or improve them and, and to make people have opportunity to live their lives to the fullest. I got started in, in politics as a, from a campaign standpoint and then um, decided to, to run for office to, uh, for the Board of Supervisors. So I was, and then I was elected at 34, and I was the youngest elected elected official in Alameda County. And so I ran at that point for the state legislature and thought I would be there for a couple of years, a couple of terms, and ended up um, staying for 20 years. The lifetime ban was what I really thought, and went all the way to the United States Supreme Court. It took six years, and it worked its way through the court. And during that time, um, I did not, um, did not, and could not, because I was a plaintiff, and didn't want to run for any other office. So I was out of office. Well, when I was a cow, um, well, I was a, I was an athlete, right? I was, a, I was on the football team. I was on the, I was on the. Rugby team. I got married when I was in college. Did you meet? I got married and thought my wife was in college. Mm -hmm. She was a sorority girl, right? <laughs> a Delta Gamma. <laughs> I got married in 1960. 1960 was, a, it was the best thing that happened to me after the. Right after. <laughs> I started getting good grades, started <laughs> studying. You know. <laughs> no, what actually helped me with Cal was, was a couple of things that uh, really. Uh, made a big difference was one was, uh, was, was being uh, and making all the, the, the acquaintances that I did and friends that last to this day. But, you know, being uh, both in an athletic standpoint and also from the fraternity and in the fraternity things, you know, I got to know a lot of, a lot of people. Um, I am, as I indicated, I'm really interested in doing everything I can around around the global warming and climate change. So I'd like to continue to do that in some manner, uh, even in an office or out of office, uh, continue to work on that issue. I just think that it's really important for, for Berkeley to lead in this area and also for, for other people to, to try to do as much as possible. Individual acts mm -hmm. can add up to making a big difference. And this is just a place where things are innovating, create, and start here. And I'm happy to be part of that.